Tony from Six String Country. I'm gonna do a short demo on a guitar I recently got my hands on from Glutton Guitars in Holland, Michigan. Uh, I ran into the owner of Glutton Guitars at an event and got my hands on this and played it for a little while and just immediately fell in love with it. I just got such warmth, it felt so good under my fingers. I've been chipping away at them to sell it to me ever since um, and I finally convinced them to let me have it. So I'm not sponsored by them or anything. I paid you know, really good money for this guitar, but um, I like to do these demos when I find something I'm really excited about piece of gear or a guitar or something like this. So yeah, this is a Glutton guitar. It was made by a luthier named Scott Vandershell. It's got a Sitka spruce top, East Indian rosewood sides, back and fingerboard. Uh, it's got a mahogany, low profile neck, maple binding. Uh, he did some really nice inlay work with pearl and abalone. Um, and I had to be honest, I, I had to talk him into doing these, <laughs> these diamonds. I would have loved to do done something more ornate um, but he had it just blank. I, there's markers up on the side right here on the neck, but I had to explain to him that, you know, when we're teaching guitar lessons online, people get upset if they don't have markers in there, which makes total sense. So he understood, couldn't do anything more innate just because we'd have to refret the whole thing, which I didn't want to do. So we did these diamonds just so people could tell where my fingers were. Um, we've got LR bags, Anthem, uh, pickup in here. And it's got both the piezo underneath the saddle here. And it's got a mic in there that allows you to blend those two, um, which lets you get just a really nice, nice sound when you're plugged into a PA or recording. Uh, it's got the zero fret up here. This nut is a, a unbleached bone nut. He was really particular about not putting, that's why we don't have a, a pick guard, no plastic anywhere that's gonna affect the sound of the wood and the sound of the guitar. Um, he's just a really meticulous guy when he's when he's working on these with the woodworking and and uh, even you know just making it look really pretty and nice. And he was you know he was talking to me about how he did the bracing underneath the the top here and how he took extra care to make sure nothing was going to hinder the sound with how they were shaped or angled or anything like that. So it's a really really nice instrument. I, I you know go check them out. Glutton Guitars uh, in Holland, Michigan. So I thought I'd just tell you a little bit about it and play a little bit for you. I've got a cloud mic on here, a ribbon microphone, and I'm blending that in with uh, the pickups. Mm -hmm. 